Hey, what's up, guys? Jason here back again. I wanted to go ahead and do another Blu-ray DVD update for you guys. Um, this is a short one here. This is some stuff I picked up, you know, after Christmas with some gift cards and stuff like that. This is uh, Enter the Dragon. I actually was not even aware this was out on Blu-ray, but uh, I heard on Profondo Cinema they really talked about how how it uh, looked pretty good. So. Picked it up, checked it out, and a uh, decent transfer on there. I'd recommend it if you're a fan of this film. Definitely check out the Blu-ray. And this is one. The Sopranos. This is just season one. I know the only thing that's out on Blu-ray of Sopranos is the season one and season, um, I think the last two. What is it? Five and six or seven and eight or whatever the last two seasons are, they're out. But the rest are still not out. And, uh. I actually have not really watched a lot of The Sopranos before, and I uh, wanted to get into it. Uh, I like the uh, Boardwalk Empire show so much, I wanted to check this one out a little bit. And uh, Devin, you guys may know Devin does reviews. He had uh, he had told me, you know, check this out. It's a really good show or whatever. And I said, might as well, you know. So many people love that it. it's got to be halfway decent. So I, uh, I picked it up, and i got to say, the first episode... I only watched the first episode on here, and it really didn't look all that great. Now, this is a Blu-ray, and it's not a cheap Blu-ray either. So, as you know, the, all the damn HBO Blu-rays are out the ass, expensive. So, um, I don't know. I'll, I'll check out the rest of these, but so far, it's definitely not worth the the Blu-ray money. Um, you just check that out on DVD. It can't look any worse than it looked on Blu-ray. Um, Glorious Bastards. I finally uh, picked this one up. Price finally went down low enough for me. Um, and this is Infestation. And this is the Region 2, I believe, or Region B. This is not out not out on Blu-ray in the United States yet. So I wanted to pick it up. I'm going to watch it again. I'll probably um, do a review of it here pretty soon. Great film. I'd, I'd recommend all you guys check it out. It's uh, kind of a campy film, but um, you know, still really cool. It's... Uh, about these giant alien insects that, that take over. Uh, I'd recommend checking it out. This is Dogtooth. I think this is a, re a Region B as well. Um, I know the Blu-ray is not out in the United States yet. And I haven't checked it out yet, but this is a Greek film. And it's supposed to be like really uh, kind of weird and freaky. So I figured I'd check it out. And this is Night Watch. And this is the, uh, oh, I think it's Danish, uh, where where it came from. But they did the remake of this with uh, with Ewan McGregor here in the United States. But uh, this is the actual original film, and I picked it up and I saw Samini 1979 did a review on it, and I didn't know it was a remake, so I wanted to check this the original one out, and I watched it and I, I enjoyed it a lot. It's a great movie. And I think it's actually, it's way better than the American remake, um, even though the the remake is like pretty much a direct remake of this, except with a bigger a bigger budget. But um, same director, so one of those type deals, same director remakes it with more money in another country. It seems to be pretty common. This came out like 94. Yeah, 94, and I think the, um, the U.S. version was in 97. This is AM1200, and I've actually had this for a little while. I just forgot to show it in an update, but this is a short film. Uh, a friend of mine, Noah, told me to check this out. This is a uh, pretty cool film. I got a, a poster autograph by the director as well on this one. Check it out. A cool little short film, if you're into short films. This is a R... R Xmas. This is directed by by Abel Ferreira, who's an awesome director, and I wanted to check it out. I've been trying to find it to rent forever. I finally just broke down and bought it, and uh, this is an X rental. But um, uh, not real crazy about this one, but it's an okay film. I think Ferreira was trying to do something different with that one. Uh, Black Belt Jones, the original. It's an awesome film. This is a a bootleg DVD, but um. Decent quality, great film. Oh, this next one, I get, I give this one a high recommendation, guys. This uh, is Dead Set. It's 
This is a zombie uh, miniseries that came on in the UK. Um, I want to go watch it again. I've seen it twice already. Just awesome, awesome miniseries. This very closely rivals The Walking Dead. I may even say this is more entertaining than The Walking Dead because uh, uh, I thought The Walking Dead got kind of stale in the middle. And uh, this doesn't. Uh, it's really solid all the way through. Sorry, I got a wicked fucking glare on here. I'm trying to get it off. Uh, but, um... Yeah, check us out. This is I looked on eBay in the U.S. and this thing was going for like thirty, forty bucks. But uh, you can get it off of, off of Amazon UK for next to nothing. Um, it was only like three pounds on uh, on Amazon UK. So I definitely say check this one out. It's uh, five or six episodes, uh, maybe five episodes total. But it, what it is, it takes place on the set of the UK Big Brother. And zombies attack. Uh, a zombie infection breaks out, and uh, just really cool. If you're a zombie fan, you gotta watch this. Um, I'm not a big fan of Big Brother or any reality show like that, but it it really works and uh, really great stuff. This actually came out on uh, the IFC channel on I think Halloween is when they showed it, or uh, sometime around Halloween. I showed the whole thing and I missed it and I heard some folks saying it was really good so I'm going to check it out. Highly recommend it everybody. Class of 1984. I actually hadn't seen this film yet. I finally got it and uh, I like it a whole lot. I'm going to rewatch it. I think this uh, comes with a commentary by the director um, Mark Lest Lester. I think that's his name, but, uh, yeah, but, uh, yeah, great film, uh, Michael J. Fox is in this, Michael Fox, I think his name is in the film, um, probably one of his first, first movies to do, I'm not sure, Document of the Dead, this is, of course, a documentary on, uh, I thought it was just on Dawn of the Dead, but it's actually on quite a few films of George, George Romero. And this is an awesome documentary. This is on the Ultimate Edition of the um, Dawn of the Dead Ultimate Edition. So I, I don't have that edition. I just have the regular DVD edition. So I had to pick this up. This is the Synapse release. But uh, if you haven't seen this, definitely pick it up. It's great. Great stuff. If you're a fan of Romero, got to see it. And this is Cop. I had another high recommendation on this one. This is uh, James Woods in all his glory. And if you're into like cop dramas or uh, gritty cop shows, stuff like, stuff like that, I'd definitely say check this one out. I'm a huge uh, James Woods fan, and I've been wanting to see this one forever, and I just couldn't find it anywhere. But um, great stuff. Some great, uh, some great makeup effects in there, too. But just a, just a great film all around, great directing. This is Night of Death. This is another one that I saw Savini 1979 review. And uh, this is a French film. And uh, great stuff. I'd, I'd recommend you guys checking this out. The same uh, the same thing John said about it. It's a, it's a French film from the early 80s. Um, year 80, 1980. You don't see a whole lot of stuff coming out of France from around that time, but it's a really unique film. Um, just about this this girl who goes and, and is working in this like retirement home with all these old people, and it turns out that they're really old, and what they're doing is they're all the girls that come to work there they uh, they eat them, so that's their fountain of youth is eating young girls. So um, I definitely recommend checking it out. It's got some uh, some cool stuff in here. French horror, you gotta love it. Anyway, guys, that's it. I hope to have another video up here sometime soon for you guys on my channel. Thanks for watching. Peace.